Checking on Money Matters this morning, Disney is having a special day today to attract streaming subscribers. And home prices slid over the past month. Jane King joins us live in the NASDAQ with those stories and more in this morning's Money Matters report. Good morning, Jane. Hi, Bruce and Jen. Good morning. Well, home prices plunged the most in a decade over the past month as mortgage rates surged. Now, mortgage analytics firm Black Knight found the median U.S. home price declined three quarters of a percent from June to July. It was the biggest monthly decline since January 2011. Well, the company that owns Regal Cinemas has filed for bankruptcy. Cineworld filed for Chapter 11. So that means they'll be able to stay open, operate fairly normally while they restructure debt. Movie theaters have been struggling to get people back during the pandemic, but Cineworld also had billions in debt, so that made their situation worse. Well, the biggest reveal at Apple's much-anticipated event yesterday was not a gadget. It was that the tech giant didn't raise iPhone prices. The four new models ranging in price from $799 to the iPhone, that's for the iPhone 14, and then to $1,099 for the 14 Pro Max. The devices come with a slew of new features, including upgraded cameras and a redesigned screen that's always on. They also revealed some new watches and AirPods. And Disney is holding a Disney Plus Day today with some special streaming offers. So current subscribers can get into any Disney theme park 30 minutes before it officially opens and Disney also giving subscribers six months free of a Nat Geo digital subscription. Live from the NASDAQ market site, I'm Jane King.